always got an incredible message to share. Please get up out of your chairs and, enter, and welcome Ernesto Verdugo. Thank you, everyone. I, I want to share with you a little bit of what I am doing and what I have been doing. I mean, uh, possibly some of you knew me from before that I was involved uh, doing internet marketing. Um, I have been, before an internet marketer, I've been a trainer. I was uh, a trainer for KLM Royal Dutch Airlines here in Dubai. I came here to Dubai when Sheikh Zayed Road only had the Toyota buildings and the Crown Plaza. How many of you remember Sheikh Zayed Road with only those buildings? Well, I've been here since 1993. I feel as Dubaian as you have, even though I leave, I always keep on coming back. And I have always been bringing speakers uh, to Dubai. So far, I have brought 200 speakers. So it's a, it's a lot of speakers. <laughs> um, I do not know of anyone else that has done the same thing or has accomplished the same thing. But now my goal is to also expand, to take people from Dubai and take them to other places in the world and create a real uh, community of leaders, a community of people that have a message and I want to share it with the world. And this is what is really driving me uh, forward. And I want to share with you today the three elements that you require in order for you to be attractive, to be hired as a speaker. Would that be interesting? Fantastic. So there's three elements. The first, and you don't need to, you do not have to get confused with this, is you need expertise, which is a body of knowledge. That is very important. Now, please do not confuse expertise with experience, because a lot of people have a lot of expertise, but they feel that they don't have experience in the platform. They do not have experience. Talking in public. How many of you think that a good public speaker can make a lot more money than any other person? Public speakers are everywhere. CEOs, leaders, anybody that can talk in public would always be better perceived than people that don't do it. And bear in mind, I know people which are shy, that are great public speakers, because they connect with the heart. When the message comes with the heart, you can deliver a message anywhere. So first of all, we have the expertise. All of us are experts at something, and sometimes we don't even realize. Just bear in mind, it took me a long time to realize that I was an expert speaking around the world, and I knew so many cultures. I didn't realize how much valuable my information was. I have had the honor and privilege to present in 59 different countries to audiences of 119 nationalities. Do you think that that gives me a competitive advantage with many other people? Yes. Now just think about it. How many nationalities have we got here in Dubai? 200. Do you think that you instantly are an expert in dealing with different cultures? I mean. For example, I know very much how to motivate a Filipino. Give them a microphone. <laughs> They'll start singing instantly. I know my cultures. I know how to, what to say to uh, different groups of audiences because, of course, I have spent a lot of time here in Dubai. You guys have exactly the same thing. So even if you think that you don't have an expertise, just search inside how much expertise do you have and you will be able to really get your message across. Point number two, you don't have to worry about the experience that you have on stage because of course the idea is to actually get started and start talking. Second thing which is very important is you need to have proof. Proof is the next thing that you require. That's what most people, most speakers fail. If you don't have proof that you have been on separate audiences, for example, 
Now there is proof that all the speakers that are here have spoken in Dubai, but they, don't, they, they didn't only speak in Dubai, but they also speak in the Burj Al Arab in Dubai. They spoke also in Google in Dubai. They have been speaking in different places. Now they're going to be speaking in Thailand, in London, in different places. Wow. Now that has already created proof for them. So when they are asking for a speaking opportunity, they have the proof to prove it. So then you have the proof. And the last one is you need personal branding. You need to be branded as different. Because if not, people are going to keep on seeing. I mean, you're going to be lost in the crowd. So those are the three points that you require to become an international speaker. And from me, I would like to connect with you. I would like you to be part of our tribe. And that's why I would like you to visit the website that we put together for you, speakindubai.com. Thank you very much. It's been a pleasure being with you.